Narcissists, pathological liars, they commonly engage in lying because they have patterns of dishonesty and manipulation. But let's talk about the different types and degrees of lying. I'll outline four types and I'm going to leave the one that affected me the most for last. Let's start with pathological lying. This one is a consistent compulsive pattern of lying. This one goes beyond the typical pattern of dishonesty displayed by most narcissists. Pathological liars, they fabricate stories, they're dishonest for seemingly no reason, and they have difficulty distinguishing the truth from falsehood. Some narcissists are absolutely pathological liars, but it's not a distinguishing trait of narcissism. The second one is much more common. This is habitual lying. They engage in chronic or habitual lying as a means to control others, as a means to maintain their self-image. They lie about things like their achievements, their personal history, their abilities, but they're doing this to enhance their status, to gain control, or receive admiration. The third is exaggeration and self-promotion. This is when they're embellishing their skills, their achievements, or their qualities just to get attention and validation. They'll stretch the truth, but it doesn't reach the degree of pathological lying. Now the last one is selective truth-telling. They'll selectively tell you the truth, or they'll present a distorted version of their reality. This is all to suit their needs. They'll omit crucial details, lie by omission, manipulate facts, provide partial truths, and this is to manipulate others or avoid accountability. Lying behaviors, they exist on a spectrum. They don't all lie in the same way or to the same extent. Some narcissists rely heavily on deception and some use it more sporadically. Which of these four have you seen the most in your relationship? Stronger.